From brand new animal species to those who have been around for centuries, but always found a way to remain unrevealed, these are the 10 chilling discoveries made in Africa that'll blow your mind. Let's get it going. Number 10. New Species of Mammal We start our list of exciting discoveries in Africa with a finding of a brand new mammal species, a tree hyrax. The animal was discovered through genetic analysis and examination of its physical characteristics, which set it apart from other species of hyrax. The researchers believe that the tree hyrax is endemic to the region of the Taita Hills, Kenya, meaning that it is found nowhere else in the world. The discovery of the new species is significant because it adds to our understanding of the diversity of life in East Africa and highlights the importance of conservation efforts in the region. Hopefully, we'll all be able to somehow help preserve this exciting area. Number 9. Principe Scops Owl Scientists have also discovered a new species of owl on the African island, a principe, and it's just the cutest thing. The new owl is named the Principe Scops Owl, and it's tiny with bright yellow eyes. The owl was first spotted by birdwatchers and is believed to be a new species of the Otis genus. The discovery of this new species is especially significant because it highlights the importance of biodiversity conservation in remote areas like Principe. The scientists hope that their findings will help raise awareness about the importance of preserving the habitats of these unique creatures. But as is the case with the tree hyrax, further research is also needed to find out more about the Principe scops owls. Number 8. Giant Prehistoric Fish Moving on, we must mention the chilling discovery of an animal that lived on this planet quite some time ago. Scientists have discovered the remains of a giant prehistoric fish in the Makanda region of South Africa. The fish, which lived approximately 360 million years ago, was a top predator in the rivers of the ancient supercontinent Gondwana. It is part of the Tristacoprid family, a family of giant, lobe fin fish, and has been named Henaria udlezinje. This is an exceptionally significant discovery because it could mean that all these giants from the Tristacopterid family originated in Gondwana. Although we must wait for new research to be conducted in order to find out all the mysterious things revolving around this species of ancient fish. Number 7. Oldest African Dinosaur Scientists don't fail to surprise us with mesmerizing discoveries, as they have recently found the oldest dinosaur ever discovered in Africa. The Embryosaurus Rothi. This dinosaur roamed the Earth around 180 million years ago during the early Jurassic period and belonged to a group of plant-eating dinosaurs with long necks called sauropodomorphs. This discovery is really exciting because it helps us understand how sauropodomorphs evolved and spread across the world. Africa was part of the supercontinent that we mentioned before called Gondwana at the time. We still have a lot to learn about the Embryosaurus rothi and finding this new dinosaur is a huge deal for paleontology as it gives us a better idea of the incredible diversity of life that existed on Earth so long ago. Number 6. Slender Snatter Crocodile This next extraordinary scientific discovery happened in Central and West Africa, where researchers have recently discovered a new type of crocodile, a new species of Slender Snatter Crocodiles. This species, however, is not new, but was simply unknown to humankind up until recently. They got their name because they have a long tail snout that serves for catching fish and other small prey. This new discovery is super exciting, mainly because it reminds us of how important it is to protect the different species living in Africa. Sadly, this slender snatter crocodile is considered a vulnerable species and is threatened by things like habitat loss, hunting, and even illegal trade. By learning more about this new unique species of crocodile, scientists can work on ways to protect them and keep them from disappearing forever. Number 5. Voiceless Frog Scientists also discovered a new species of frog in Tanzania, and the interesting part is that these guys don't make the typical croaking sound that we usually associate with these amphibians. Instead, it makes a kind of soft, purring noise. The new frog species named the Croakless Frog, and more specifically, Hyperolius ukugriensis, has been described as having a brown or olive green color and is about the size of a golf ball. It's believed that this frog evolved to be voiceless as a way to avoid detection by predators. But whether this is the real reason or not, these frogs are really the discovery of a lifetime. Number 4. New Orange Colored Bat An exciting discovery of a new species of bat in West Africa called Myotis nimbiensis has occupied the attention of the public. These orange-coated bats are not only a new species, but they also have a one-of-a-kind feature. As their nickname suggests, their fur is bright orange. 
Researchers believe that this unique coloring may help them blend into the environment and avoid predators. The orange-coated bat was discovered during a field expedition in Guinea, where researchers set up mist nets to capture and study local bat populations. Upon closer examination, the team noticed that the bats had a striking orange coloration that had never been seen before. Genetic analysis confirmed that they were indeed a new species. This discovery is particularly significant because bats play a crucial role in maintaining ecosystems and are often under threat due to habitat loss and hunting. The orange-coated bat is a reminder of the many species that are yet to be discovered and the importance of preserving our natural world. Number 3. First Pygmy Seahorse Have you heard of Africa's first pygmy seahorse? Scientists have discovered a new species of pygmy seahorse in the Sadwana Bay, South Africa, making it the first of its kind found in African waters. This tiny and elusive creature was identified as a new species after close examination of its physical features and DNA analysis. The Sadwana pygmy seahorse is only around 0.7 inches in length and its body is covered in a unique pattern of orange and white spots, which helps it blend in to the surrounding coral reef. The species is considered a rare find due to its small size and cryptic behavior. Researchers hope that this discovery will bring more attention to the need to protect these fragile and important marine ecosystems. Number 2. Lasula in 2012, a new species of monkey was discovered in the Democratic Republic of Congo, and it was named Lasula. This remarkable primate has a unique and striking appearance, with a bright and vivid orange and blue face and expressive eyes that seem to reflect human-like emotions. Researchers believe that the Lasula is closely related to the owl-faced monkey, which is found in Central and West Africa. Despite its distinctive appearance, the Lazula is a shy and elusive creature, and very little is known about its behavior or habitat. Conservationists are concerned about the long-term survival of the Lazula, as its habitat is threatened by deforestation and human encroachment. The discovery of the Lazula has generated significant interest among primatologists and animal lovers alike, and has led to renewed efforts to study and protect this fascinating new species. Number 1. A Gorilla in Congo our thumbnail picture showcases the famous paleontologist Raymond Dart, shoulder to shoulder with a gorilla that he had captured back in the 1930s. Raymond Dart, known for his significant contributions to paleoanthropology, was also a scientist with a diverse range of interests. He recognized the value of primate studies early in his career and established a colony of captive baboons in the anatomy department of the University of Witwatersrand, Johannesburg in the late 1920s. His colleagues conducted notable behavioral and endocrinological research on these baboons. Dart's involvement in primate studies extended beyond captive colonies. In 1930, he participated in a scientific expedition to hunt a mountain gorilla for research purposes and also conducted primate field studies. In 1957, Dart and another scientist founded the Witwatersrand University Uganda Gorilla Research Unit to study the Virunga Mountain Gorillas, resulting in pioneering studies on their behavior and their natural habitat. Dart was actively involved in mountain gorilla conservation and also studied South African Chakma baboons in the wild. What was your favorite among these amazing discoveries made in Africa? Share your thoughts in the comments down below, hit that like button, and subscribe to our channel for more extraordinary animal videos.